to Sui Kanen. I'm Katie, and in this episode, we're going to continue on with the storyline. Um, I'm hoping tonight I'll finish this game, so I've only got a couple more missions, and I think I have three total missions and a re one recruiting bout to do, and then I'll be completely done. Let's go to the fourth floor here, and then I'm going to be taking some time off a way to edit, and well, not just to edit, but also to do a compilation of combo attacks and such, so it'll be interesting. You're back. Was your meeting with the Dragon Knights a success? Uh-huh. Did you manage to secure an alliance? Don't worry, medical officer. It's just that Humphrey could be a little friendlier to others. By the way, who's the silent fellow here? Kasumi and Kren captured him hanging around the castle. He refuses to say anything, so we were waiting for you to come back and decide what to do with him. Tyr, are you Commander Tyr of the Liberation Army? Thank goodness, now I can comp complete my mission for Master Warren. I kept silent because I was under strict orders not to speak to anyone until I met you face to face. Kazim Azil, who took over the northern defenses after Teo McDall, has recently begun to apply extreme pressure on rebel factions. He's looking for a comeback. My master Warren is a famous man of wealth in the north, long respected by, long respected even by the Imperials. But as a man of honor and generosity, he harbored many fugitives in his mansion. As a result, his home was surrounded by Kazimazil and his troops. Master Warren and Sir Victor, who just happened to have dropped by, fought hard against the Imperials, but they were eventually captured and taken prisoner. This is what Master Warren told me to tell you. Commander Tier, Victor is one of our most powerful soldiers. Warren, despite his wealth, is an honorable man with a large following. We must go and rescue them. The President Kazimazil's troops number more than 8,000. And they're a trained army, whereas we're just a ragtag munch. Commander Tier, despite its name, the Liberation Army is not yet a unified army. To continue fighting in the future, we need to give the troops some proper military training. I agree. Let me make the necessary preparations. I suggest you retire now, Commander Tier. You have a busy day ahead. Guess we're gonna go to bed, I guess, in the game. I guess we could have went and did a recruiting bout, but there's no point in just doing a few people and then having to go back and do another recruiting bout later. Commander Tier, I have an important matter to discuss with you. Fun in, Matthew. Commander Tier, it appears that a spy has infiltrated the Liberation Army. While you were away, I sent Kasumi and Kren on a reconnaissance mission into Imperial territory. According to their report, it appears that there is an intelligence leak somewhere in our army. So if you permit, Commander Tier, I'd like to over to oversee the military military training maneuvers tomorrow. Jesus Christ. As you wish. Thank you, sir. You must be tired, Commander Tier. I will leave you now. Commander Tier, the coming battles will become increasingly fierce. I am prepared to do anything to win, no matter what the sacrifice may be. Oh wow, <laughs> um, I guess somebody's like <laughs> commenting on one of my videos already, jeez. Thank you for the first comment on ever on any of my videos, hooray for me! Mirror tier, everything is ready. Good, let's go. All troops will now head north to attack the Imperial forces. What? So suddenly? I thought this was just a drill. The Imperial army will think so too. We mustn't miss this opportunity. We will attack the north immediately. Surprise attack. No wonder there is so much equipment for a drill. We will now head north. Commander here, please confirm. Alright. Master Griffith, Liberation Army. 
Huh? Yes, I know, I know. They're out training today. They're suddenly attacking us. Yes, I know, I know. You mean to say that our spy was mistaken? My god, what shall I do? How far have the Liberation Army advanced? They're right in front of our eyes! Mm, this is a serious problem. Alright, you go report to General Kazim while I try to stall them. Battle at the Northern Checkpoint. Liberation Army has no mercy, no time for breakfast? Oh, excuse me, but I must say it's pretty late for breakfast. It's not your business. In any case, we're badly mismatched. We surrender. If we can avoid bloodshed! Of course, but some soldiers may prefer not to surrender, so give me some time. This is a ploy to stall us. We're, we'd better attack at once. Give out the signal! Damn, we couldn't fool them. Troops, do the best you can, but don't waste your lives. Alright, so we're gonna go into the ninjas again. Ninja, 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 ninja. It is bow attack. So we shall charge. That was easy enough. I thought that if I joined the Imperial Army, I was all set for life. I was wrong. Yeah, you idiot. <clears throat> Hell, I guess we lost. All right, all right, we surrender. Lives are precious things. Recruit. Join you and betray the Imperial Army? Promise me one thing, will you spare my troops? Of course, I guarantee their lives. Then I'll agree to your, pro your proposition. Whether I'm fighting for the Imperials or the Liberation Army, it makes no difference to me as long as I can eat. Master Griffith, we will follow you. What wonderful men you are. Thank you, everybody. Commander Tier, we will march north before the enemy finds out that we have taken the northern checkpoint. Sir Lapat, I'll give you a battalion to attack the fortress of Duha. I understand. Sir Humphrey, I'll assign another battalion to you. Take the fortress of Rakhan. As protector of the north, Kazimazim will be forced to re send reinforcements to re respective fortresses. Meanwhile, we will sneak into Moravia Castle and rescue Warren and Victor. This mission will be carried out by yours truly, Commander Tyr, Kasumi, Kryn, Griffith, and three others. I don't mind being a decoy, but what if the reinforcements attack us? We'll have no chance of winning. The Imperial troops arrive, retreat immediately. Then we won't have time to sneak into more of Via Castle. Don't worry. We do have asked for support. Support? The Dragon Knights? No, but they're still a dependable force. Those are the details of our plan. Please take action immediately. Commander Tier, please select the party that will break into more of Via Castle. Alright. We're gonna bring our most powerful with us again, so let's bring in. Luke and we'll get Ruby and we'll bring in Hellion. Okay, so what I'm gonna oh, never mind. What do you want with me? Griffith, you're going to help us sneak into Moravia Castle. What do you mean? Griffith, I want you to pretend that, you're cap that you captured me. Commander Tyr will enter the castle with us disguised as one of your men. I see a ruse, eh? I don't mind, but do you really trust me? Think of the fate of your men should anything happen to me. 
It's true that I would make an excellent present for your former leader, but you are not a man who would betray your own men. You see right through me, don't you? Alright, I'm in. Now that that's settled, let's hurry to Moravia Castle. Commander's here. Yeah, I don't give a shit about Krang because he just sucks. Um, first off, I need to do a few things here. So I'm gonna um, go off screen. I'm going to drop off all the stuff, and then I'm gonna go ahead and have. I'm gonna put one of the runes on Ruby. I'm not sure which one, so I'll be there soon. Okay, so I'm back at the northern checkpoint here. Old book volume 7, nice. At least, like, Krim's just useless. Worthless. I just see that there's just a bunch of just background. There's, like, nothing else here. Just a bunch of land. And now the fortress of Rakan. The Liberation Army is making fools of us. I'll teach them a lesson. As far as no one saw Tyr there. Why, Sir Griffith, I'm glad you've survived. We heard you were attacked. It was hell, but they shouldn't have underestimated me. Look who I have here. This is Matthew, military strategist of the Liberation Army. I took him prisoner. Let me in. I'd like to report to General Kazim. Yes, sir. I will inform him immediately. Please wait a minute. This is really going to work? If it doesn't, I'll escape by myself. <laughs> What a thing to say, Kryn. You leave Master Tear behind. <laughs> God, he's a jackass. Please enter and proceed to the waiting room. I can't fucking stand Kryn. Commander Tear, while Griffith and I are in the waiting room, you must get Victor and Warren. The prison should be on the top floor of the castle. You must hurry. I'm not sure how long I can fool General Kazin. If they capture us, we're dead. Let's hurry, Tear. Let's grab this treasure. Pink paint, that's what I figured. So if you talk to this guy, I'm the castle's records keeper, what do you want? You can rest and save here so we can do that real quick. So we shall save real quick here. Alright. Alright, let's so continue on this delay. We had to come back here to recruit someone anyway here, so. I'm gonna give that to Kasumi because screw Krim. Give him that karate uniform, I'll be a little bit generous. If it wasn't for my hell spell, I don't think Kryn would be doing anything. He'd be dead in two seconds. House! Alright. As you can see, Kryn is just worthless. And nobody has any healing. Well, besides the healing wind, I guess, we can use. Kryn is useless. He's worthless. He's a piece. At least I'm starting to get my money built back up again, which is great. Because I'm going to need it for my final party. I'm going to be using a lot of healing wind. Kryn's worthless ass. Oh, wait. This way, never mind. Okay, so. Luke also died, so... Alright. It's only for fuck's sake. It's those dog trainers that really... kill off my cat. Mega Medicine, finally, I don't have to use all my spells. We can't cross this. <laughs> I'll take care of it. 
So I wrote from the beginning. There we go. <laughs> We got wing boots from that. I wonder. Get them to consume me, of course. Whoa. You know, pointless. Well, actually, it has a point. Didooch. Okay, this last little part here. We did it, Master Tear. This must be it. You're late, Tear. I've been waiting forever for you to show up. <laughs> Why don't you stay a little longer and cool off? What did you say? Who do you think you're talking to? You can catch me if you can. Master Tear, I've opened the lock. Thanks. Whoa, uh, I'm just kidding. You must be Commander Tear. I'm Warren. Thank you for coming for us. Didn't I tell you they'd come, Warren? You certainly did. We don't have much time. Let's hurry. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Matthew Silverberg? Three, maybe four years? Why did you leave the Imperial Army? Because of that incident? That is one reason, but more because I dislike myself intensely when I'm fighting. And yet you joined the Liberation Army, strange man. Why don't you come back to us? I'd rather not execute you as a traitor. You needn't worry about that. What do you mean? General Kazim, we're surrounded by the Liberation Army! I see, those attacks on the fortresses were a decoy. You're getting rusty, Matthew. When re the reinforcements return, the Liberation Army will be wiped out. If they return, that is. What's that? We have just received word that the troops sent out to protect the fortresses were ambushed by the Jousten Army. What? Why are those? You did this, Matthew! That is correct. I sent Jousten a letter informing them of Imperial plans to invade their land. But say, say, if Jousten is hungry for this empire, it's quite easy to manipulate them. Traitor, you dare sell this land to the city-state! I have no such ambitions. I merely manipulated them. In no way have I joined hands with Jousten. It was just likely that the city-state will temporarily occupy this region. But the Liberation Army will permit no more than that. Jamie, you know how you conniving turncoat! Master Matthew, are you alright? We've pretty much taken care of business outside. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we're just in time. General Kazim is ill. Now it's my turn to make a request. Please surrender. The ideal emperor, empire you once envisioned has changed beyond recognition. The emperor himself, to whom you pledge loyalty, has changed too. Do you still plan to cling to the past? I still... You are a stubborn man, Kazim, like the rest of the five great Imperial generals. Think about it. Do you think that the Emperor is the same man we once knew? I don't. You know he isn't. You're one of the Emperor's loyal followers. Isn't it your duty then to try to convince him to mend his wrongful ways? The five great generals were unable to prevent the Empire from deteriorating. Therefore, the time has come to help the Emperor open his eyes. Do you not agree? All right, I surrender. I'm glad you understand, General Kazim. We must retreat immediately, Commander Tear. If we wait around too long, the city state will attack us. What? Nothing for me to do? Shucks, I was looking for a good rumble. All right. Let's just finish this up then. I'll just drop off all the good stuff and then uh, end the episode, I guess. I think I will be able to do the next recruiting bout right now instead. I think I have to do it now before it gets too late to do it. So we shall drop off the pink paint and the old book seven. Just double checking. Okay.
right. So, in the next episode, I'm hoping to do our final recruiting bout. That would be awesome. And if you liked what you've seen, please give me a cheeky little like. And if you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing. That would be dope. And thanks for watching. Thank you.